I was the first one to make a Crucial. Um, it it changed my life. Um, it really did. It it. It opened my eyes to the fact that I had to make my faith my own, and I had to develop a, a relationship with God. Um, so, naturally, I wanted to bring Claire into it. I, you know, I couldn't wait for her to make a weekend to where we were on the same page. Uh, when when he came home from his Curseal weekend, he was a, 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 I could tell something had changed in him. He was uh, kneeling by the bed praying, and. Uh, that was something I never noticed. Um, I'd never seen him do before. By that time, gosh, we had been married over 20 years. And um, so uh, I saw that that was something that I wanted, or I wanted to see how I could be changed. Um, I could be shown the way. I think I knew immediately that I needed to improve my prayer life and, and actually become a good Catholic. Uh, I was the guy that went to church on Sunday and, and I may, have, may go to confession once a year, maybe not, you know, and I thought that I was a good Catholic. Uh, so it opened my eyes that I was, I was doing the bare minimum. There was a, an immediate change to our marriage bond that uh, Christ became the center of our marriage. And we really didn't know, I, I don't know that we realized he wasn't the center. Right until you know how to make him the center. So um, I'm just very grateful for that. Also, as soon as you enter Sarto and you walk down that hall, it, there, there's just a, a, a welcome, warm feeling uh, that all of that comes flooding back to how Jesus met you in that space. We learned very quickly how blessed we are to have uh, Sarto because there were some dioceses that did not have a retreat center. And, you know, they would bus them into a church and stay at a hotel and, and stuff like that. And, you know, Sarto is, is a, just a wonderful building. I think the Curseal weekend is only the beginning of what the benefits of Curseal are. Um, Curseal shows you a way. Um, I, you know, I always think of this, um, this phrase as, um, Jesus is constantly seeking us, but how do we seek him?